Uh, hi guys, uh, this is Sushant Kuchar and today we are going to talk about how our bodies burn fat with cardio. Uh, so I talked about what cardio is in my previous videos you, and I'll link that video at the end of this video. You can check it out if you want. So basically, um, let's say we talk about the cardio that usually people are uh, seen doing in the gym. So let's say I am uh, running on treadmill at a speed of 8 or 9 or maybe I am cycling at a moderate speed, maybe I am uh, working out on treadmill on a moderate speed, uh, maybe I am skipping the rope uh, on a moderate uh, speed, <coughs> low to moderate speed or maybe I am jogging in the park. So the, that type of cardio burns your fat when you are doing it, that type of cardio burns your fat when you are doing it but uh, it mostly stops burning your fat after you have done it so uh, basically if you were jogging for an hour you're mostly burning fat for an hour but after that you'll burn almost uh, almost zero energy not necessarily zero energy until unless that cardio is uh, high intensity so we had talked about high intensity cardio in my previous video. So you cannot be doing high intensity for one hour. You cannot be running at your maximum speed for one hour. So, so you will have to take breaks in between. And that makes high intensity cardio, high intensity interval training. You will do high intensity for some time and then you will have to take a break or you have to go to low intensity. And then you will again do high intensity. I have talked about this in my previous video. I will link it. So, if you are doing high intensity cardio, uh, then you will be burning fat after you have uh, done your cardio. So for example, I did high intensity cardio for 15, high intensity interval training for 15 20 minutes. Uh, after those 20 minutes, I will be, I will still be burning fat for uh, many hours or maybe more than 24 hours. Uh, so, I, what I wanted to do in this video was, I wanted to discuss uh, how cardio burns fat because I am going to be comparing it with weight training in my uh, next videos and I am going to talk, be talking about how weight training burns fat. So, uh, so mostly high intensity cardio burns fat even after you have done that cardio but mostly uh, the cardio which usually people are seen doing in the gym or the park uh, as usually called a steady cardio or steady state cardio where you keep uh, doing the same movement for long periods of time like jogging for an hour or 30 minutes so for example uh, uh, I am walking uh, so walking for an hour burns about 170 to, uh, 175 to 225 calories for an average person so we take an average of 200 calories uh, burned per hour for uh, by walking so let's say I have to burn 500 calories, so I'll have to walk for 2.5 hours. Let's say I am jogging, so uh, jogging burns about uh, 200 calories in 30 minutes. So I'll have to uh, jog for 75 minutes to burn 500 calories. So this is an idea I want to uh, give you for the steady state and of if you're doing high intensity for 15 20 minutes or maybe and maybe you burnt only 150 to 200 calories doing that high intensity cardio but after that uh, after those 20 minutes you'll still be burning calories so you basically you worked out for lesser time and you'll eventually be burning more calories uh, for the amount of effort that you had put in for the time uh, that you had put in for your workout so uh, basically I wanted to talk about this and now uh, in my video, in next videos I am going to be talking about how weight training burns fat and how um, weight training and cardio are different in burning fat. Uh, if you like this video please like it if you have any comments put them in the comment box. If you like the channel please subscribe. If you uh, want to receive notifications for my future videos turn the notifications on. Bye.